you, but before I pass it out for you to look at, um, we are going to do uh, an activity that's also going to help you in your classroom with community building. So if everybody for forward can get on their feet. Start to left, please. Start to left. Oh, and protect your laptop. Close it to the office. Get there. Yes, ma'am. That's a flag. <laughs> Why are you being mean to me? Okay, guys, something that I've noticed as I'm visiting classrooms is there is a lot of students who are asking for more movement activities. Um, and I think it's a really good way for them to get their wiggles and their giggles out before you jump into the meat of your lesson. That way they're not trying to get it out while you're trying to teach. So this is a certain type of community building circle that works like musical chairs. There's all kinds of circles you can do. You can do a restorative circle after a fight. You can do a grieving circle after a group of friends lose somebody. You don't want to do the musical chair version for that one, but you do want to do some type of let's get together and talk it out. So this one is more community building. And how it's going to work is I'm going to play some music, and we're going to pass this volleyball around. Whenever the music stops, whoever has the volleyball has to answer this question. What do you think is Devin Parm's spirit animal? Ready? to whatever your lesson is about. So today's lesson for me is about redirections. So what I want you to think about as we're passing this time is what is a redirection that works for you that we didn't show on the big graphic? What's one that works for you? Excellent. Well done, good. Okay, y'all keep thinking it's the same question. You can stop recording that. Really, I'm gonna put that up, and that'll help us. Record. 